And now, Professor Frank DeFelice. Watch him. You will never forget what you are about to see. It's called Qi. Qi. It all means internal energy, power. You could consider it to be a life source. Without breath, you're dead. So I, it's that one, it's the breath inside you, the air, that controls the energy. At times, you breathe heavy to do heavier things. At times, you breathe light when you're doing nothing. So it's controllable. You begin from absolutely nothing, learning to control your breath just to be standing there. I can remember getting dizzy just breathing. And you learn to direct it to different areas of the body. Mostly to the organs. I'd rather have a kick in the groin than, than a good professional hit me in the throat. This form of breathing that myself and these other instructors do, this intense, should not be taught to just anybody. I think it should be limited to black belts who prove their self. This is Joe Hess, six foot four inches, 240 pounds, and a third degree black belt in Gojiru Karate Do. Perhaps the most powerful man in the martial arts in the world. To me is a weapon, somebody that... <laughs> ...doesn't know how to fight at all, that knew this, could stand right in your face and defy you to hurt him. I don't want people to get the misconception that if you do this, you can't be hurt. Because I believe that this form of key energy, there's definite levels of it. I'm at a certain level. My instructor is at a certain level. And I believe that if the time should come where I, I am punched by a professional that has in his punching ability more energy than I have in my absorbing ability that you know where the weakness is going to be it's going to be me and maybe fortunately for me due to this time I have involved with this breathing, I won't be injured fatally, but I recognize the possibility every time I do it. I'm aware, I'm aware that I could either be dead or not dead. It's nothing in between. If you are up to the standards and you try to do it, you're as good as dead or you go on your way to the hospital. Because medically, the books I have state that people that do this are dead. Once again, watch Teddy Wilson observe the power of his kick. <laughs> 